EFNN, The Tiger Financial News Network. TFNN Headline News Update. Good morning, everyone. Basil Schaap, and here's the Tiger Financial News Network. 10 a.m. market update, and we're looking at uh, the Dow on this uh, Thursday, the 18th of August. Down 92 points at 33,886, and that's one of the reasons why we started taking profits in our positions that we've started uh, weeks and weeks ago. It's really important at this stage that the Dow, certainly the weekly chart is, is uh, tomorrow at 4 o'clock will be an important benchmark because it's finally broken out to the upside. But this is a choppy period that we're anticipating. So you've got the Dow down, you've got the S&P down. Uh, after the peak F slash B and with the doji candle, silent doji yesterday, now it's down 11 at 42.62. There's still residual strength. If you look at the strength of the um, nine period over the 14, if you look at the MACD, the stochastic at 91%. So we've got to see how this plays out. Looking at the QQQ, that's the NDX 100 um, vehicle. Down a dollar forty six at three twenty seven, right on the two hundred period exponential moving average. Another important benchmark. We're looking at the IWM uh, down only twenty seven cents at one ninety seven thirty six. Is this the phase where we start to see the small caps start to hold better on any pullback? We'll be looking at that closely. We're also looking at gold. Uh, up four points at 17.80, just stuck underneath that 14-period uh, moving average because the dollar has been holding quite well. Uh, today, it's up 16 ticks at 106.81. This is a, kind of a sideways move, only if the, Dow go, the dollar goes to 107.80, 108.20 in the next week will we see something change at this particular point, still a digestive phase. Looking at crude oil, crude oil hit that 200-period moving average a number of times and now is actually bouncing up $1.26 at 89.37. And this is a very important moment for crude because all the technicals are kind of weak. So what happens next makes that 84 area in the crude oil very important. The TLT, we're looking at the TLT up 74 cents at 115.44, just stuck in this lower range. That means yields are kind of stuck in an upper range. And I'm going to uh, stop now because I want to tell you that you've got great programming here on this Thursday. I'll be doing the Tiger Technicians Hour. Then you've got, I think, the no, then you've got Steve Rhodes, and then you've got uh, uh, Larry. Oh, boy, did I get that mixed up? Yeah, then you've got Think of Swim Larry for the event of Dave White and Tom O'Brien. And Tommy O'Brien sauces us off at 9 a.m. in the morning. Market kickoff, great show, great start to the day. I'll be back in a moment for the Tiger Fitness Hour. Check it out.